Me voy a enamorar, pero nunca casar. Yo solterito me quiero quedar. ¡Cumbia! from the Zapotec word Yushi, which in Spanish means Tierra Suelta, which was excellent for cultivating a large variety of crops. Jalapa, which is now located in the southern part of the state, was once located along the Tehuantepec River. In 1938, the first monks found the people of Jalapa scattered all over the area. They brought them together and as a result, they established only one town and began building a Catholic church. Under the influence of these monks, the town's name was changed to Santa Maria Jalapa. later became part of Hernán Cortés Kingdom, who was known as El Marqués del Valle de Oaxaca. That is the reason why Jalapa is now known as Santa María Jalapa del Marqués.
dam was built on December 1st, 1961 by Adolfo Lopez Mateos. The dam has a capacity of holding 942 million cubic meters of water. 47,000 hectares of land can be irrigated. Si el corazón te cayorona en aras de un tierno amor. Being in Jalapa, it is a worthwhile to take a boat trip on the calm water of the Benito Juarez Dam to look at a town sunken by Mexican technology to save others. Más hermosa que una flor Por una linda peguana llorona Más hermosa que una flor Ay, 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 llorona Llorona Church of Jalapa, which was built mainly of bricks and some rocks, can be observed every year during the summer. Me quitarán de quererte a Llorona, pero de olvidarte nunca. Me quitarán de quererte a Llorona, pero de olvidarte nunca. Can you tell me about the Jalapa's traditions or festivities? Mira, una de las festividades más importantes, empezando con el mes de enero, es el 20 de enero, es una semana de fiestas en donde se por así decirlo, hay una exhibición de trajes regionales. Este, hay velas eh, en las noches, en las cuales se galanan con los diferentes tipos de trajes, costura, bordado, y este, hay regada de frutas, capitanas, capitanes, y este, es una mayordomía. De allí, otra de las festividades que tenemos es en Semana Santa, con la cual ahorita coincide en, con la feria de la mojarra igual y este, pues la mojarra se cocina en diferentes presentaciones para que las, los turistas, las personas que nos visitan eh, pues conozcan todas las maneras de, de preparar y aparte pues difundir ¿no? el hecho de que tenemos la mojarra What are some of the pues mira, tenemos la presa, ¿no? que es uno de los atractivos más grandes y que pues desde mi punto de vista le falta un poco más de enfoque turístico, o sea, quizá más, se puede decir, este, actividades acuáticas, o sea, para aprovecharla. Pero pues sí, la gente puede ir, estar este, allí. Ahorita hay un restaurante cerca que se come bien, o sea, todavía es típico, y sobre todo las mojarras que son las que sirven. What makes uh, different Jalapa from other towns? Pues su hospitalidad. O sea, aquí la gente, eh, pues casi todos nos conocemos, ¿no? nos saludamos todos los días, nos encontramos en los mismos puntos de reunión, como pueden ser la escuela, el parque, el mercado, o sea, ten, todavía estamos en pequeño. Y pues es, la gente es muy hospitalaria, muy amable, así, y este, si alguien viene y pregunta por alguna persona, algún lugar, o sea, inmediatamente, como te decía, no se pueden hasta de la mano lo agarran y lo llevan. Entonces, este, yo siento que eso hace la diferencia también, ¿sí? que todavía no hay mucha desconfianza. ¿sí? Orden toda 
Angel Lady, another festivity that is popular in Jalapa is Semana Santa or Holy Week, which happens to be celebrated during the same week as La Feria de la Mojarra or Mojarra Festival on the second week of April. After that, other festivities follow such as Santo Domingo on August 4th and Asunción de María on August 15th. Nowadays, based on what the lady said, Jalapa lacks of touristic activities, mainly in the dam, but people can visit La Cortina. Finally, people from Jalapa are very friendly, and everyone knows each other. Hi guys, this is the main part of my town. Uh, come with me, let's check it out. I hope to enjoy it.
Hi guys, we are here at this restaurant in Jalapa del Marques and we are here uh, to try basically some of the different varieties that you can find of the mojarra. As you guys uh, can see here, we can uh, see the mojarra mojo de ajo and this one right over here is called uh, mojarra empapelada. Uh, these are two varieties of, 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 of uh, the mojarra that you can find here in Jalapa del Marques. Obviously you can also find other varieties and you guys are welcome to come anytime to visit Jalapa and try this wonderful dish. That mojarra had something special, man. Yeah, yeah. It's all no man. Well, guys, this is the end of our trip. I hope you have enjoyed it. I hope you visit Jalapa soon. Thank you for watching. Now? Yeah. Hey, we need a taxi, you no? Know? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Where yeah. Is Get out of here, get out of here, yeah, yeah. Okay guys, this is the main market of my town. Come on with me, follow me. Mojarra, which is the best mojarra here in the east of the east of the Guatepec. Go well, follow me, let's go. Hi! Let's uh, go into <laughs> The main attraction of Lampa is the dam. Uh, it's very known as La Presa. So that is where Jalapa Viejo or Old Jalapa was ubicated. <laughs> <laughs>